Pittsburgh, the ESPN College Football Prime Time presented by Applebee's. Tonight, the Miami Hurricanes taking on the Pittsburgh Panthers. The Panthers just taking the field, going through a corridor of former Pittsburgh players, more than 300 expected here tonight for the first reunion between the Hurricanes. Be better. Temperature is still in the 80s. The humidity is very pleasant. At a baseball game here earlier today for PNC Park. Pirates are playing better. It's a perfect night for sports here in the Steel City. And going to get things started off. Kevin Harper will kick it away to the very dangerous Lamar Miller. He took one back to the house for a touchdown against Ohio State on September 11th. Just about set to go from Pittsburgh. And away we go. ACC in the Big East and Miller driven about five yards deep into his end zone and Miami will put it in play from its own 20 yard line. Here is Ja'Cory Harris threw for over 3,000 yards a year ago. He's the quarterback of the Hurricanes. He also threw 17 interceptions last year Jesse. Well and he tied a career high throwing four interceptions against Ohio State but the coaching staff loved his demeanor the last two weeks. He's been a leader. He's been his old goofy self joking around. Believe me there's not another guy in a Hurricanes uniform tonight that's been more anxious for this game. We'll see a pro style offense from the Hurricanes. And immediately, we start with no running backs. On first down, the first pass was aimed at the tight end. Oh, wait, the guy can run. There is Damian Barry. His first carry of the night gets up close to the 30 yard line. It'll be third and a little bit less than a yard. Jared Holly on the stop for the Panthers. And you know, when we talk about the similarities of these two teams, up tempo, you might see a little bit of it, but they bottom line execute and they like to run the football with the big guys up front. Barry hitting the backfield, stretching and straining toward the 30. The officials coming across close to that yard marker, but Jabal sheared. Harris to Travis Benjamin. Benjamin has another Hurricanes first down. Greg Romeus that you mentioned a moment ago, Frank, he had surgery on, had a disc problem that flared up really before the season even started. Tried to play a little against Utah, but was not his normal dominant self. Again, look at Greg there. He's a big East co-defensive player of the year. Sheard will have to step up tonight. Barry. Little bit of running room on first down. Well, Pitt led the country in sacks last season, and their M.O. the last two years. Mark Whipple, the offensive coordinator, has the Canes in a quick tempo. Harris up top. Got a man out there. It's Benjamin. He's got it deep in Pantherland, and Miami's on the doorstep. Well, one here that you notice immediately is Pitt does not blitz a whole lot. They dial it up, and Miami takes advantage one on one outside. This tempo has really caught Pittsburgh's defense by surprise. Damian Barry's in the backfield. First and goal for the Hurricanes. Barry's going to pick up a couple, so the big is really, as you said, Jesse, setting them back some. Snaps on the ground. Chorus. Corey Harris is hitting the backfield, and flags are flying everywhere. It was sheared. Back here to now. Bill's second and goal. Barry in the backfield, along with Patrick Hill. Barry has it. Barry's hitting the backfield, and he is crunched again. He won't get there. Big junior from Pittsburgh. Yeah, red zone now is an issue here for Miami. Got to get in the end zone. That up front, that line, that D line. Play. Look over the right side. Big freshman Chantrell Henderson is in. They'll run it behind him, and it's a touchdown for the Hurricanes. Damian Barry's in. Top offensive line recruit in the country, and he's over on that right side helping clear the way. This is a big, physical Miami offensive line. Not the most athletic offensive line in the country, but when they put their hand in the ground, they can rock off. Blowing back Pittsburgh on that touchdown. Ten plays, 80 yards, and Matt Bosser for the 100th consecutive time in his career is true on the extra point. He's never missed one, and he has it now. Damian Barry, his first rushing touchdown of the season in Miami, strikes first up on Pittsburgh, 7-0. So Miami prepares to kick it off with a strong leg of Matt Bosher. The Panthers will get it for the first time tonight. Cameron Sadler bringing out of his end zone. 
And he's not going to make it to the 10. Now the Panthers will be guy Team knows it. Miami knows it. It's just a matter of who can who's going to win in the trenches. Sinceri, first play will throw it, getting a little heat, and Tino is going to go down with a sack. Miami has excellent pass rushing in. And on defense, Sean Spence, a dynamic player, started his career two years ago. The freshman All-America had a career-high 11 tackles against Ohio State. On second down, Lewis finding his way through the hole and getting across the 10-yard line before Spence. They have to cut down on the mental mistakes. Lewis in the backfield with Sanceri on third and ten. A little shuffle pass to De Dion, and he just gets drilled. Sean Spence, number one punt return team in the country. They have both Travis Benjamin and Lamar Miller deep in an effort to keep Pittsburgh from kicking it away from them. This time, Miller will get a chance. And he goes absolutely nowhere. Excellent coverage on special teams by Buddy Jackson. Special he was in his freshman season. Second possession of the night for the Hurricanes. They marched right down the field and scored the first time. On the ground. And then Barry <laughs> scored the touchdown. He's welcome to the Steel City. <laughs> Harris to Barry. And Barry will have enough of the first down. Tristan Roberts on the stop for the Panthers. How about offensive coordinator Mark Whipple keeping his foot on the pedal right now, staying in up tempo. He's not going to give this Pittsburgh defense a chance to catch their breath. The one thing that we've noticed at the up tempo offenses are the defenses who are able to line up and get calls made before the snap. Harris. LaRon Bird. Bird's going to be knocked down. Close to a first down. A first down. They're doing that again here tonight. We got a shot of Phil Bennett, the man charged with trying to slow this hurricane offense down. And had Barry in the backfield for a moment, and good support from Antoine Reed, the cornerback, coming up to. It'll be a first down. Again, Chantrell Henderson has returned. On the right side is Miami has extra lineman up. Harris. Throwing deep again, Benjamin's out there, and DeSico goes for the interception, and he got it. Bugaboo hitting Harris. Ja'Cory Harris has a great home record of not throwing many interceptions, only 10 at home, but on the road, he's thrown now 19 in his career. He just pushed that ball, Jesse. Well, the problem for Miami is that that was a maximum protection. They only had two receivers out in the route. Don DeSico at six foot four, he's able to go up and high point that football over the five foot 11 Travis Benjamin. That just has to check down or right. throw away. I was going to ask you, would you have thrown that? No. That's why I'm up here. Sunseri. <laughs> <laughs> Dino's got some wheels and he'll pick up about four before he's chased point, If we were still in the NFL, as Mark was for a few years, I could cut you and get some more if you don't, <laughs> if you don't run the right routes. That was really funny. This one might have been on Jacory. Really true. Deion Lewis hit immediately and <laughs> Olivier <laughs> Vernon hit him first. Oh, you just got to back him up and get him out of there. Now, Ray Graham has checked into the backfield. Very dangerous in the passing game for the Panthers. Third down. Sinceri. Mike Shanahan underneath. He'll be knocked down by Sean Spence. Went back to it on third down, but Miami had figured it out, covered it up. Travis Benjamin took one back 79 yards first career touchdown return him Miller became the first hurricane duo ever to return a punt and a kickoff for a touchdown in the same game Miami had two return men back last time this time Travis is back there by himself bit of a high snap Hutchins will get it away Benjamin will call for the fair catch and the hurricane on ESPN 3D and online as always. Hurricanes. One touchdown, one turnover, and Corey Harris has had a couple of sacks, but this is just a smart recognition of what the play is going to be. Get your hands up, deflect the pass. Lamar Miller checked in the backfield. Harris puts it right on LaRon Bird for the first down. Here is Harris. 
No blitz coming. Throws it again. Looking for Bird and he has him again and those two have been on the same wavelength. Yeah, no, he puts it in as he can the more he grasps put in more. Now keep it on the ground with Miller. And Miller love gets play. it. We love the play calling. Please keep it going. You see what ha Whipple has on the play sheet now. Showing pressure. Pittsburgh looked to be in the neutral zone. It might not matter. Miller got a close to me. Lindsay will have opportunities. You'd think they'd send a little more help towards the ball sheared as the night goes on. Second and seven now. Harris delivering in to traffic. He was looking for Ford. Reminds Miami's coaching staff a lot of Jeremy Shockey, but he's a little slow getting out of his break. He gets pushed a little bit, and the timing's totally off. Now the crowd rising up on a third down. Hurricanes. Again, looking for Bird, and that has become a security blanket. Washer will kick it away. Sadler coming up, and now he's going to clear everybody away from it. Takes a really nice Miami bounce inside the Pittsburgh 10. And all of it coming your way in what will be a great Saturday for college football and certainly a major hurdle for the Broncos. Ray Graham. In the backfield, he has a short game. miss up in the box. Has run through his shoulder. You can't dance around that. Graham is still in the backfield rather than Deion Lewis. On a second down, Sinceri fires it hard and low. Was looking for a third and seven. Looking at the young quarterback as Pitt tries to avoid his third straight three and out. Sinceri fires and it's incomplete. Devin Street yeah, he has to. I agree, but. The young quarterback's been unable to get it started, so Travis Benjamin now is going to have a shot, and he's dangerous. Benjamin, there's a flag down. This one is probably coming back. Travis won't come back, but I think the football will. Benjamin the takes same it. meeting together. Did I hear that the ball is going to be punted out of bounds? <laughs> did did I hear said. that? And the first two I've seen now, I've been like, okay, uh, they're getting away with this thing here, punting this ball to Benjamin. He took it back. A little trickeration on the end around and second down and 16. Corey Harris sheared got through there. He dumped it to the back and not much of a gain. Defense has sniffed out. A third and 15. Pittsburgh defense to give their offense another chance. Sheard's in the backfield and down goes Harris. Said he's going to sack one. You cannot block Jabal Sheard with only one player able to just use a speed rush right around Jermaine Johnson. That, that's one of the easiest. Panthers need to get something going on. Oh.